Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve if you get an error that says check this cannot continue in read only mode. So this error will usually come up if you're trying to run the check this command on your main hard drive or some kind of external drive. So if the drive is currently has a write protection or read only functionality, so you're going to have to make a couple of quick changes in order to resolve that problem. So basically I would suggest scheduling a check this upon rebooting or restarting your computer. And in order to do that it's going to be quite simple. First thing I would actually recommend doing if you don't know what your drive letter is would be to open up the start menu, type in computer. Best match should come back with uh, this PC or one of the best matches I would suggest clicking on that. And you just want to take note of wherever your local disk is here. You can see in parentheses it's my C drive. And you can tell it's your local disk and it should have a little Windows icon above the drive icon. This is our drive that we want to do our scan for. So it's going to be my C drive, my main hard drive here. And because I'm currently in Windows, it's not going to let you run the chat this utility on it. So we're going to open up the star menu, type in command prompt. Best match should come back with command prompt. You want to right click on it, left click on run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, left click on yes. Now in this elevated command line window, you want to type in chk dsk space forward slash r space and then whatever drive letter you want to scan. So like I showed you guys, it's my C drive. And then I'm going to do a colon. So basically one dot on top of another dot. So again, chk, dsk, space, forward slash, r, another space, and then it's my C drive with a colon attached to it. Then you're going to hit enter. So give it a moment here. So it might say check this cannot run because the volume is in use by another process. Would you like to schedule this volume to be checked the next time the system restarts? You want to type the Y key on your keyboard, so just the letter Y. Hit enter. Should say the volume will be checked the next time the system restarts. And that should hopefully be about it. And honestly, if you guys were running the check this utility in the recovery option, so if you were going through recovery tool, you could run the same kind of command in there as well. And it'd probably be even more preferable because you'd be outside of the operating system itself, so it shouldn't have any issues when trying to scan. But I do have this brief tutorial was able to help you guys out. And as always, thank you for watching. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.